Parker getting ready to do it big time here. 1 0 must go. Is that what you guys have been saying throughout yeah, the week? Yeah, 1 0. Some, somebody's O's got to go. Um, and somebody's one's got to go to the two. Yeah. Or just. There'll be a one across the board. John Henning coming out in the south ball position I, here. I tell you, I saw uh, uh, Zach Cooper uh, when the, you know earlier in the day he was warming up in the cage, and he has some fancy, fancy footwork. Yeah. It's going to be uh, interesting to see if he, if we get to see that fancy footwork, or he's just going to, you know, stick to. Well, those two right kicks right are pretty fancy so far. Yeah. John Henning actually filled in on this fight in a uh, about a week and a half notice as well. Um, yeah, uh, he needs to keep his hands up, you know, especially for a guy that's already filled oh, head nice kicks. catch there. Nice catch. And counter. And, yeah, counter, man. That was pretty good. And those head kicks that you're talking about, Ben, they were coming super fast. Yeah, so you need to, can't, be, can't be testing the waters, Easy man. Work, Easy work, <laughs> David, in your opinion here, what are the strengths of each of these competitors uh, and, and, and the game plans that they should enact here? As we're... As we're going so far, like Ben just said a minute ago, you know, um, John needs to pick his hands up a little higher. Zach looks, uh, he, he keeps his hands up well. He's throwing a good combination. He's fast, uh, fast hands, fast kicks. I think we're going to see a head kick knockout, I'm going to be honest. I think, uh, I think, uh, oh, Zach Cooper's just uh, stop, stop with those head kicks. Yeah. And he's going to end up throwing them. He's going to end up throwing them when he forgets it. About well, like you said, the left hand of, of John getting very lower low. and lower and lower. Start throwing some low kicks out there. Probably what Zach should do, and then yeah. go right back to the high. Or kick like we said, saw earlier today, you throw those jabs. We saw those jabs, and then out of nowhere, the head kick. You know, going to be the southpaw trick of John Henning that uh, that is, is causing uh, Zach Cooper to, to take some time and, and uh, kind of get a read on things. I uh, fought a southpaw guy, and what I did is I faked a takedown, and I kicked him in the head. It was a good uh, good little fake me. You want to know if I knocked him out? Well, yes, I did. Uh, <laughs> you know, you hear the slap of those kicks, and yeah. you think, you know, it's, it's fun to listen to or whatever. It's not fun on the inside. Every single one of those, regardless if they land oh, you in, feel a, it. in a solid. And you definitely feel yeah. it the next day, too. So They're swinging baseball bats out there at each other. Yeah. Louisville Sluggers. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky, so get it. Um, yeah. But yeah, this is a this is a very technical, smart fight. This is a, this is a kind of fight I love and enjoy watching. We are live on FlowCombat.com. It's a tremendous stream. We're so happy to be a part of it. Of course, a big shout out to our sponsors: Ogle Elrod and Burrell, Wireless Express, Johnson City, Matt Tatter Studios, Chips Transmissions, and all the rest. We are so thankful. So, starting to snap those yeah, so Ben, up. in your estimation, who is, is ahead on the cards here right now? Uh, you know, uh, Zach Cooper by an inch. I think that he's uh, uh, being more of an active one. He's, uh, he's pursuing it more. He's pursuing more of the striking. So. And you see he's, uh, he's circling towards his opponent um, uh, uh, facing the cage. He's, told, so he's taking the center so, of the cage yeah, several times. Cage, yeah, yeah, and he, oh, here we go. And we go for a takedown. There's a takedown on uh, uh, Zach Cooper's end. Once again, like we said, he's he's he's, he's going towards uh, uh, you know trying to finish, trying to win. And that's what the judges look at. Half guard position here on bottom for, for Henning. He does not have the underhook. David, is is that going to be an issue here? Uh, with the half guard in, in the mixed martial arts situation for John. Yes, I mean, do you, do you think that Zach Cooper is going to be able to, to do some damage here? Yeah, most definitely. Half guard's a great position for MMA. Right here, what he needs to do, back, uh, push him into this corner here, keep him pressed against the fence. And uh, it's professional, so I'd like to see him start dropping elbows if he can. Uh, work up a little bit higher, brace on the brace on the head, and then drop those elbows. Yeah, they're still young in their uh, uh, professional uh, career, so they, they still have a, like a, a feel for not throwing elbows yet. You know, they still have to uh, understand, you know.
now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit, I can throw him. And he back to the feet, but it could be that takedown that really definitively makes a difference in this first round for the scoring. See, his, uh, his, uh, his coaches, his corner, his corner from uh, uh, Zach Cooper's corner,